Hi, this is Andrew Moore Crispin with your Butterscotch.com tutorial on using accessibility options on your Android phone. Using a smartphone can be difficult for people with visual impairment. Android has some accessibility options that can make things a bit easier. From the home screen, tap the menu key. Choose settings. Scroll down to find accessibility and tap to enter. At the top of this page, tap the box beside accessibility to turn it on. Below, we'll see the accessibility services available. Tap the box to add a check mark in order to turn any of these services on. You'll receive a warning that the service could conceivably log and capture data that is typed. Unless your phone has been compromised by malware or the like, this is no cause for concern. Talkback will read text on the screen as well as text that you type. If we go back one screen, Settings. you'll hear the phone announce the name of the screen. Settings in this case. Tap back into accessibility. Accessibility settings. That too is announced. Soundback adds some navigation sounds to your Android phone. If we hit the home button, we'll hear one such sound. Tap the menu key, settings, and accessibility, and we'll hear the sounds again. Kickback adds vibration to the mix. Tap home and you'll feel a slight vibration. Tap an app to open it and you'll feel a slightly different vibration. Finally, the power button option allows you to change the way the power button works when you're in a call. Tap the box to turn this service on and your power button will now end a call in progress rather than locking the screen. It's not so much an accessibility option as it is a user interface tweak. That's how you use the accessibility options on your Android phone. For more helpful mobile tech tips and tutorials, visit butterscotch.com. Thank you.